Oh, hi guys. So I decided to make a tutorial video on how to make thumbnails using a Microsoft PowerPoint. First of all, you don't need to master in PowerPoint to make thumbnails. You don't need to watch long tutorials to learn their basics. And there is no need of working on Photoshop because this tutorial is pretty simple. So let's get started. When we open a PowerPoint, we see a page like this. As you can see, the aspect ratio of this page is 4 is to 3. Thumbnails will look dull with a 4 is to 3 ratio as the image will be stretched. Let's go to the top bar, the menu. Click the design button. Can you see the design button? Yes. As you can see, the page setup over there. Click that. Select on the screen show 16 is to 9. That means we are selecting 16 ratio 9 aspect ratio. Press OK. Now you can see the page has stretched and the page has given us some more space to concentrate on thumbnails. Now go to google.com. You can write anything. I will write dark green wallpaper. You can choose whatever you want, blue or black or any other desired color. So let me choose a proper image for my gaming video. My video is basically about a Mortal Kombat 4 Shinnok gameplay. It's a fighting game with some horror and gory graphics. So I want something to be creepy. Okay, this image is perfect for my thumbnail, but it is blurry. So it's a no, no. Okay, this image looks cool and a bit creepy. So right click on it and save it in your hard drive. Go to the PowerPoint, right click on the page. Now select format background. So let's choose picture or texture fill. This brown picture will automatically appear as a background. Click file and let's choose the background we downloaded from the Google. The background looks pretty cool. I would like to add some shade to it. Let's make a rectangular over it. It's a blue opaque color. Right click on it. Choose format shape. Let's make the transparency up to 50%. You can actually choose any percentage of transparency, but this is my personal choice. So the background has got the blue shade. It isn't that cool. Let's try something else like red. Ah, that looks creepy and nice. It would, I can relate my video with this texture. Let's try green one. Nope, nope, nope. Pale red. Ah, oh, that's nice. It looks pretty cool with that. Now let's work on Shinnok. Go to google.com and type Shinnok PNG. Mark my words, PNG file. And now you can see Mr. Shinnok's PNG poster. Now right click on this image, copy and paste it on the PowerPoint. Now let's resize this image. Now PNG file is a rasterized graphic file format that supports the lossless data compression. The image is actually compressed so we can't see any background, just the fucking image. Ah, that's better. Now I will write Shinnok over the top left corner of the page. Let's color it white. The fonts are not that catchy. Of course, they are not catchy. We have to make sure that the fonts are attractive enough so that the audience can click on the video thumbs. Let's try this font. It's not so nice, so I actually chose my Smudger LED font for my last video. And this looks amazing. Okay, so we have chosen the Smudger LED font and increase the font size. Now select the whole text and right click on it. You should choose Format Text Effects instead of Format Shape. Can you see the Glow and Soft Edges? Go to Glow and Soft Edges. Select the black color. You can choose any color you want. But I choose black one because I think it's good. Okay, now it looks just perfect. Now I will overlay Mortal Kombat 4 logo right there, which I've taken from the google.com. You can take it anywhere. Whatever your game is, your whatever you think, you can download from the Google. It's time to make my channel logo. Select this eclipse right there and draw a very small circle because it is my logo. It's a circle and the JG on it. Okay, so let's choose format shape and let's choose purple color or any other color. I will choose this color because I'm comfortable with this. Let's go to the line color, choose black. Now go to the line size, increase the width up to the 5. Let's place my JG text over here. My font style is orange light. And let's color it white. Here we go. Now I would recommend to screen capture this page during slideshow like this and save it in the MS Paint because it will produce high quality. If we save it in the PowerPoint as a JPEG image, it will be clear, but it won't be a large image. We want the large image. MS Paint will produce a high quality thumbnail and mention the size and save it as shinnok.jpg. Now, can you guys see this difference between two images? They are very high quality and the image size is completely perfect. 
So this was my tutorial for how to make the thumbnails. I hope it was helpful for you. Comment down below about your thoughts about whatever I cover in this video and any assistance you need, you can comment down below. So thank you guys for watching all. Have fun and peace out my spooky Jojos. And make sure that you subscribe to my channel.